It's at a 531 now view police report a 24 year old man died when his motorcycle crashed into another vehicle on West Iron Street about 730 Tuesday evening. Speed was a factor. As MTN's John Amy tells us many residents in this neighborhood have been concerned about speeding on that stretch of road for a long time and they say something should be done to prevent further tragedies like this. A deadly traffic accident on this section of Iron Street is a tragic example for many residents in this neighborhood that too many motorists are driving too fast on this road. Yeah, I right there, right there. That's it, that was 45 miles an hour. Unbelievable. For three blocks on West Iron Street, the speed limit is 35 miles per hour, but the road suddenly becomes a 65 mile an hour entrance onto Interstate 90. Residents say many motorists ignore the speed limit. These people don't care. They do not care. Once they turn that corner on Iron Street, it's an immediate highway. Residents have made many complaints to city officials, including reducing the speed limit or the number of lanes on the road and increasing traffic enforcement. There's a school bus stop right on the corner. Um, elderly neighbors walk through here for daily exercise. You've got people who ride bikes for exercise, you know, and they treat it like it's an interstate highway. This week, a 24-year-old Butte man was killed while riding his motorcycle at high speed and struck another vehicle at the intersection of Iron and Travonia. The Montana Highway Patrol says it uses crash prevention units to crack down on speeders. The troopers are out uh, in force in groups work targeting a single area and those have been very effective. We've issued several citations and warnings also. Motorists exiting the interstate on this eastbound lane are greeted by two large 35 mile an hour speed limit signs. But residents in this neighborhood believe more needs to be done to remind motorists to slow it down. That's an everyday occurrence. Every day. He'll be the next one. He'll be the, that kid right there will be the next one we picked up off the highway. In parts or pieces. Here's some stats for you. Traffic citations issued by Butte Silver Bowl Police. 200 traffic citations in June. Speeding, reckless driving, and other traffic offenses. The Montana Highway Patrol, 2,282 speeding citations since January 1st.